happy sunday everybody this is carmelita with 401 pound weight loss journey and that there was my wife miss paulette i'm shocked she got into the camera today so she <laughs> she normally don't like being on camera i don't but today is a good day we're going to, um, to lay down on some beds at sleep number we're getting ready to purchase the bed for our house in georgia We've already started furnishing it and ordered furniture and appliances and things like that, which due to Corona, everybody's buying homes, everybody's buying furniture, everybody's doing everything. So everything is backed up for at least, for, I'm gonna get her, for at least uh, two months. It's taking at least one to two to three months for you to get your items. So anybody out there, if you're purchasing a home, um, and you're talking about, oh, well, I'm going to wait to order my furniture. I'm going to wait to order my appliances. Don't do it. Do not do it. Advice. Take the advice of me, Carmelita, and order your appliances and things now. We ordered our appliances about two weeks ago. And they shall not arrive until either late September or early October. That's how far out it is. But anyway... Let's get this day started. I'm going to show you guys a little bit of what's going on with us today as we um, look for our bed. Talk to you later. This is Carmelita, 401 pound weight loss journey and with, uh, with Paulette. See you at the store. Okay, YouTube. This is Carmelita. We uh, decided we haven't eaten um, breakfast. It's 12 o'clock in the afternoon. So we're at this little spot called Gem Rock and Vacaville it's a Jamaican restaurant and it's really good nice family owned business and I'm gonna turn it around so you guys can see it it's nice and there's nobody in here but us and the cooks which make it even better so uh, we'll be able to take off our masks and enjoy our meal yes yes so this is it this is the restaurant it's a cute little spot and that's my view from the window. So it's a nice little little restaurant. So, and we're the only customers in here at this time. Uh, most people are getting their stuff to go, which is great. So we don't have to worry. Ugh. Especially with this Delta variant. So this is the beginning of my day. And I'll hit you guys up once we go bed hunting. Okay, everybody. Ooh. Excuse my hair. It's got kind of wild and willy. But I've been testing out the beds. And I'm sorry I forgot to tell you, show you guys. But I tried out this bed. So far, I'm a 50. And I'm going to try out this PA. I've tried out the uh, I8. I just tried out an I10. So now I'm trying out an I8. That was what we tried out? Oh, it was a P5. It was a P5, so now we're going to try. That's a P5 over there. Yeah, it was a P5. It was a Performance 5. Now we're trying out an I8. So we'll see how this goes. Sleep number. So let me get over here. And I'm going to lay on it and see how it works. How it works. Okay. Uh, oh, sorry, guys, about that. Oh. All right, so the lady's going to talk to me, so I'm going to let this go while she talks. She adjusting Paulette right now. She hasn't started adjusting me. Ooh, child. I definitely see your Look at these chi But you're not going to feel it as dramatically like yeah, you yeah, yeah. I don't know what's going on. So I don't feel nothing yet. So you say it's more air chambers on? Uh, so they all use air technology to adjust the support. Okay. But the cushion oh mount changes ah. mattress yeah. to mattress, so you'll feel yeah, less of a dramatic drop. drop. Okay. With the air technology, because there's more cushion in between you and the air technology. So okay. So you will feel it less on here because there's thicker cushion. Okay. So the thicker the cushion, the less air air technology is in there. 
It's still working the same, but less of a feel. Less of a feel. We feel it less. Yep. Okay. Same air technology, but less feeling, depending on the thickness of the mattress. But I can take it down to 30. We can test it. You know, obviously the body ain't gonna lie yet. You know. So, so I don't feel anything. You're just working with her right now, right? Yes. Okay. I do. I like to sleep on my no chance. I wish, guys, I wish I had a got you when I was on that P5. It was awesome. Yeah. Okay, guys, when I tell you, I, what bed is this we're on? I-8. The I-8. The I-8 is the one. It is the ticket. It is so darn comfortable. Yeah. Very comfortable, honey, honey. Uh, yeah, I think we're gonna get this one and the split. Um, sticker shock is I don't know how much this bed cost, so we're about to find out. You know how much they cost on average? Have you checked? Yeah, 100. Four to five, I say three to ten thousand. <laughs> That's a good rate. That's a great rate, actually. How much is this one? Well, I'm, I'm pulling up for discounts right now. So oh, okay. Luckily for me, Miss Washington over here, she's a sleep number girl, so she's had sleep numbers in the past. So maybe we'll be able to get a little discount because of her purchasing these high end beds in the past. Tell me again, what's the address of where your bed is? So. It's going to be going to 7170 Babylon. Okay, well, we did it, guys. We bit the bullet and we purchased the 360 sleep number I, I8, uh, flex level two. So, um, yeah, we just got the bed out the way. Whew. Furnishing the house is a lot of money and uh it's fun and stressful all in the same time but um getting ready for that retirement date i keep talking about and just pray to god everything works out and i make it there where i can just really sit back and enjoy life and um within the next 10 months i'm gonna be doing a lot more shopping and uh continue renovating um the kitchen and the basement those are the only two things that's getting renovated oh and eventually the backyard when i had a pool put in there but as of right now it will be the entryway it's a beautiful towel entryway but it's old-fashioned it's not my style so i'm gonna do that um the kitchen is not a full gut job i'm keeping my cabinets because i love them just doing backsplash countertops and lighting and then the basement it's a finished basement but i'm gonna redo the basement because it's dated so anyway thanks for watching hope you all enjoyed this um day out this is karma leaving and paulette with 401 pound weight loss journey please hit that like button if you like this video share my videos and my content and i will talk to you later and remember, peace and love is the only way to live. Bye now.